there is life on Mars. It would be so exciting to wake up in the morning and think that that's, that's what's happening. Michio Kaku, the celebrated physicist and pioneer of string theory, recently highlighted some groundbreaking findings from NASA's exploration of Mars. Among these discoveries, one stands out for its profound implications for life beyond Earth, the presence of water on the red planet. Kaku's insights into this revelation not only captivate those keen on space's mysteries, but also underscore the potential for life in places previously thought barren. Number 10. Evidence of Ancient Tsunamis Michio Kaku has shown a light on a fascinating discovery on Mars that could rewrite our understanding of the planet's history, evidence of ancient tsunamis. This revelation suggests that Mars, contrary to its current barren state, might once have harbored significant bodies of water. Geological structures on the Martian northern plains bear a striking resemblance to the aftermath of colossal tsunamis, believed to have been set off by meteor impacts. These cataclysmic events are thought to have occurred around 3.4 billion years ago, during Mars's late Hesperian period, a time previously assumed to be cold and icy. The aftermath of these tsunamis, characterized by the scattering of large boulders and debris across the plains, and the subsequent retreat of the waves, likely resulted in the deposition of ice. Such evidence bolsters the theory of an ancient ocean in the northern plains of Mars, a topic of much scientific discourse. Should this be verified, it would underscore the presence of considerable water on ancient Mars, possibly creating conditions suitable for life. Moreover, the areas affected by these ancient tsunamis could be prime targets in the ongoing search for signs of past life on Mars, suggesting that regions where water and sediment were deposited may harbor clues to the planet's biological history. Number 9. Martian Night Glows Michio Kaku frequently explores the enigmatic aspects of Mars, including a peculiar feature known as the planet's night glow. This subtle luminosity in the Martian atmosphere, observable even in the absence of direct sunlight, was verified by NASA's Mavin spacecraft. The glow results from chemical reactions high in Mars's atmosphere, where solar radiation during the day disintegrates carbon dioxide into carbon monoxide and oxygen. At night, these atoms recombine to form carbon dioxide once more, emitting energy as visible light and thus creating the glow. This Martian nocturnal radiance isn't constant. It fluctuates with the seasons, peaking at the equinoxes and dipping at the solstices, and even pulsates around three times each night. Such variations provide scientists with a window into the atmospheric circulation patterns on Mars, offering insights into how Martian winds move at high altitudes and evolve with the seasons. Studying Mars's night glow is pivotal for understanding the planet's atmospheric dynamics, including the movement of winds at upper levels and how these patterns shift across Martian seasons. These findings not only deepen our knowledge of Mars's climate history and present conditions, but also underscore Mars's status as a dynamic world, replete with intricate atmospheric and geological activities. Number 8. Signs of Past Life the quest to uncover life beyond Earth has long captivated the scientific community, with Mars emerging as a focal point due to its Earth-like history. NASA's Martian missions have uncovered tantalizing clues that hint at the red planet's life-sustaining past. Among these discoveries, the Mars rover Curiosity's detection of organic molecules in ancient sedimentary rocks, aged around 3 billion years, stands out as particularly compelling. Additionally, Curiosity observed seasonal fluctuations in Martian methane levels, a phenomenon intriguingly linked to biological activity on Earth. While the presence of organic molecules does not definitively indicate past life on Mars, as they can also arise from non-biological processes, it does imply that the essential components for life as we understand it were once present. The Perseverance rover, exploring the Jezero crater, a site believed to be an ancient lake, aims to uncover more concrete evidence of ancient microbial life, such as biosignatures, that could further substantiate the theory of Mars as a once habitable environment. Although these findings fall short of confirming extraterrestrial life, they contribute crucial pieces to the puzzle, suggesting that Mars could have supported life in the past. Number 7. The Discovery of Water Water, a resource we often take for granted on Earth, is a rarity in the cosmos. The discovery of water on Mars marked a monumental leap in our quest to comprehend the cosmos, 
suggesting that the Red Planet might once have harbored life. Thanks to advanced technology and missions like the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter, Curiosity, and Perseverance rovers, scientists have unveiled evidence of Mars's watery past and its current reserves of ice. These breakthroughs were initially hinted at by the presence of water-formed minerals like hematite and gypsum found on Mars, mirroring processes observed on Earth. In recent advancements, instruments such as the Mars Advanced Radar for Subsurface and Ionospheric Sounding on the Mars Express spacecraft have cut through the Martian surface, revealing vast underground ice reservoirs and even a hidden subglacial lake, reminiscent of those beneath Earth's polar ice caps. These revelations underscore the dynamic nature of space exploration and Mars's potential as a former or current abode for life. Michio Kaku's emphasis on these discoveries sheds light on the continuous evolution of our understanding of space, illustrating how each discovery paves the way for future missions and the tantalizing possibility of one day colonizing Mars. Number 6. Polar Ice Caps Michio Kaku often brings to light the fascinating polar ice caps of Mars, features that not only draw parallels with Earth's own polar caps, but also distinctly underscore the red planet's unique environmental and geological narratives. Mars is adorned with polar ice caps at both its north and south poles, primarily composed of water ice with a substantial presence of frozen carbon dioxide, or dry ice. The Martian winters are so severe that carbon dioxide from the atmosphere solidifies, adding seasonal layers to these ice formations. The northern cap, known as Planum Boreum, is notably larger and more level compared to the southern cap, Planum Austral, both exhibiting a stratified appearance akin to tree rings. These layers chronicle the seasonal accumulation of ice and dust, offering insights into Mars's climatic cycles. Research, especially from the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter and Mars Express missions, reveals that the northern ice cap alone harbors enough water ice to blanket the planet with a water layer over a meter deep, suggesting Mars's rich water history and its potential for past life. Number 5. Discovery of Organic Molecules Mijio Kaku recently shed light on a groundbreaking discovery on Mars, the identification of organic molecules, marking a pivotal moment in our quest to uncover life on the Red Planet. Organic molecules, which are carbon-based compounds essential for life as we understand it, suggest Mars might have once possessed the critical components for life to flourish. This revelation came from NASA's Curiosity rover, which during its exploration of Gale Crater, detected various organic compounds within an ancient lake bed using its sample analysis at Mars Instruments. These instruments heat soil and rock samples to release and then identify organic molecules such as benzene and propane. The finding of these molecules within mudstone, a rock formed from ancient muds, suggest that Gale Crater might have hosted a lake billions of years ago, offering a potentially habitable environment. While the presence of organic molecules on Mars doesn't directly prove the existence of past life, as these compounds can also arise from non-biological processes or arrive via meteorites, their discovery is a significant indicator of Mars's potential to support life. Number 4. Existence of Methane Methane, a basic organic compound, has sparked considerable excitement among scientists exploring Mars, largely due to its potential implications for life on the Red Planet. This intrigue centers around mysterious fluctuations of methane detected in the Martian atmosphere, a phenomenon that mirrors seasonal changes. On Earth, living entities are the primary producers of atmospheric methane, leading to speculation about similar processes possibly occurring on Mars. NASA's Curiosity rover, a key player in the investigation of Mars, has reported seasonal spikes in methane concentrations, with readings swinging between 0.24 to 0.65 parts per billion during Martian summers. These findings, made possible by Curiosity's advanced analytical tools, suggest a dynamic process at play. Theories abound regarding the methane's origins. Some scientists point to abiotic processes like serpentinization, where water interacts with certain minerals to produce methane. Others consider the possibility of methane being released from clathrates, structures where methane is trapped in ice, freed by shifts in temperature. Perhaps most tantalizing is the hypothesis suggesting the presence of microscopic life forms on Mars, mirroring terrestrial methanogenesis. Number 3. Ice Reservoirs on Mars Michio Kaku has highlighted a groundbreaking discovery on Mars that could redefine our future explorations. Vast ice reservoirs beneath the planet's surface, 
This revelation is crucial because water is essential for life as we know it. The existence of ice suggests Mars might have been hospitable to life in the past and could support human missions in the future. Mars is known for its polar ice caps, visible from Earth, which are made of both water and carbon dioxide ice. Particularly, the southern polar cap contains a permanent layer of water ice about three kilometers thick. The Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter has unveiled more about Mars's icy secrets, identifying large subsurface ice deposits across its mid-latitudes. These deposits, discovered by the orbiter's Sharad radar, mix layers of ice, dust, and rock, hinting at resources accessible for future explorers. One of the most striking findings is an ice reservoir comparable in size to Earth's Lake Superior, hidden beneath Mars's surface, shielded from the thin Martian atmosphere. This ice is remarkably pure, with a minimal mix of dust, offering a clean water source for future astronauts. Moreover, the discovery of a possible saltwater lake under the Martian South Pole's ice cap by the Marsis radar on the Mars Express spacecraft introduces the thrilling possibility of liquid water existing under specific conditions. Number 2. Mars Ancient Rivers and Lakes Mikio Kaku often highlights Mars's captivating terrain, pointing to the ancient rivers and lakes that sketch a story of a once-wet Mars, contrasting sharply with its current arid state. This narrative is bolstered by high-resolution images from orbiters, revealing a Mars crisscrossed with channels, valleys, and deltas, all hallmarks of past water activity. Among these relics, the vast network of dried river valleys stands out, eerily reminiscent of Earth's own river systems, suggesting they were shaped by long-standing water flow. NASA's rovers, acting as our robotic geologists, have ventured into areas believed to be ancient lakes, unearthing clues about Mars's hydrological history. The landing site of the Curiosity rover, Gale Crater, was specifically chosen for its past potential as a large body of water, roughly the size of Connecticut and Rhode Island combined. Curiosity's discovery of rounded pebbles is a testament to the enduring power of water, indicating rivers that once meandered across the Martian landscape. The Perseverance rover's current field of study, Jezero Crater, adds another layer to this aqueous narrative. Once a lake comparable in size to Lake Tahoe, Jezero's well-preserved river delta could hold the key to understanding whether life once flourished on Mars. Number 1. Martian Weather Patterns NASA's exploration of Mars, through its rovers and orbiters, has unveiled a surprisingly dynamic weather system on the Red Planet, challenging the common perception of Mars as a monotonous red desert. Contrary to this belief, Mars boasts a variety of weather phenomena, including dust storms, frosts, and significant atmospheric changes that occur with the seasons. The MAVEN mission, along with insights from the Mars Reconnaissance Orbiter and the Mars Climate Sounder, has shed light on how Martian weather shifts throughout the year. Mars is home to the solar system's most extensive dust storms, capable of enveloping the planet for months alongside the growth and shrinkage of polar ice caps composed of carbon dioxide, mirroring those on Earth. Observations have recorded frost and even snowfall, with the Curiosity rover's REMS detecting humidity and ground frost within Gale Crater. Moreover, Mars is a hotspot for whirlwinds known as dust devils, which are significantly larger and more frequent than those on Earth. The planet also experiences extreme temperature swings, from highs of 20 degrees C in daylight to lows of minus 73 degrees Celsius at night. Understanding Martian weather is crucial not only for grasping the planet's geological past, but also for preparing future manned missions to Mars.